I'm Captain Daniel Lilly with Marine Heavy Helicopter Squadron 366. We are a heavy helicopter squadron. We fly CH-53 Echoes. Uh, we're able to transport uh, large amounts of troops as well as we are the elite heavy helicopter squadron in the United States military. We worked with NAG to do an expeditionary advanced base of operation up in uh, Brunswick, Maine, where we conducted a lot of uh, confined area landings into LZs that had snow on the ground, allowing us to experience what it's like to white out, where we land through the cloud of snow that comes around us. We're getting used to operating in cold weather conditions as well as under snow and icy uh, runways. We're preparing for cold weather exercise training in uh, Norway. So with Norway, the temperatures currently are dropping down to negative 30 degrees. In order to prepare for that, it's a drastic difference from the day-to-day -day operations that we have here in North Carolina. Uh, the moisture is different, the temperature is different, the winds are different. Even the amount of daylight that we have, the angle of the sun, it all changes. It's a lot of different things that when you uh, move more north, you have to adapt for every operation. Uh, additionally, you have the maintenance aspect, which becomes infinitely more difficult. As Marines try to operate on the aircraft under the cold weather conditions, everything, even the smallest task, becomes a little bit more difficult. Whether it's the leading up to the flight, the flight itself, or the maintenance that you have to do afterwards, the cold environment changes it all. We have to be able to fight in every climate place, and Norway is no exception.